In this video we're going to take a look at Frag Router or Frag Router depending on how you want to say it. It's a network intrusion detection evasion toolkit and we can see here that it will route network traffic in such a way as to elude most network intrusion detection systems. So if we want to run the tool we can run the tool with an attack type and then some optional parameters here as well and we have a list of different attacks down here which as we can see we're only able to specify one at a time. Essentially what this will do is it will take in packets from an attacker, it will fragment them based on whatever rules we provide here and then it will forward them on to the victim in an effort to bypass a firewall rules. So we're going to go and test this out. We'll, um, we've got a couple of VMs set up here. This is Commando VM which is like a kind of a Windows equivalent of Kali, a, a pen testing distribution which has quite a lot of tools um, already provided on it. So we're going to use this as our attacking machine and basically we're going to send some pings over to this Remnux machine which is, uh, this stands for Reverse Engineering Malware Linux. It's, um, I don't really hear too much about this operating system these days. I used to use it a few years ago for doing some malware analysis but this is going to be our victim. So on our victim we're going to use Snort, uh, an intrusion detection system, just to monitor the incoming packets. So we can use Snort let me just open up the help menu. We can, we'll, we'll use this and we'll be able to have a look at the statistics after we run each simulated attack. So we'll start off just by sending some pings from Commando to Remnux and then we'll set up one of these uh, frag router rules in our Parrot OS and then we'll set up a route so that our traffic will go from Commando to Remnux, but it'll go through Parrot, which will be fragmenting the packets based on whatever rules we provide here. So we'll start by pinging, let's go and grab the IP address of the Remnux machine. Take a copy of this and we'll start snort running. So snort-v and then the interface, eth0. We'll need to run that with sudo. So that's waiting now. Let's go back to commando and we'll just ping that address and you can see we get on our, our replies there which is good let's go over to Remnux you can see we're getting our echo echo reply and I'm gonna stop the ping okay there's only four pings anyway so let's stop snort from running and we'll look, wanna have a look here and see was there any fragmented packets and there wasn't we've got zero percent so now we want to go and try the same thing again, but we're going to route the traffic through our frag router here and use some of the fragmentation rules. So we need to go and set up the route here first of all. Let's go and set up, we can see here if we type root, we can bring up the options on the Windows system. So I'm going to do roots and we want to add and then we need to provide the Remnux IP. So I'm just going to copy that again. And then we want to provide our Kali, or not Kali, our uh, Parrot IP as well. So if we add that route, and then hopefully we'll be able to try this again. We need our frag route uh, running as well. So let's do sudo frag route uh, dash i eth0 and then the attack type, so I'll just do, I can't actually remember what they were, but in fact, let's open this up. And frag router. So F1 will send data in ordered 8 byte IP fragments. Let's try that first of all. And let's go back and make sure we have snort running, so it's waiting for the packets. And now if we try and send our ping again, Let's go back over. You can see in our Parrot system, we actually see from Frag Router now that these packets have been received. So they've been sent from Commando, they've gone through to Parrot, and then they've been fragmented and then hopefully have been sent to Snort. So there's only four packets sent. So let's go and have a look. And you'll see here we've got fragmented 42.553% of packets were fragmented. So we can essentially just go through and test out some different attack types and have a look and see what the results are. So we might be testing this as defenders to see 
whether our firewall is able or our IDS is able to detect attacks or we might be using this as a penetration tester trying to see if we can compromise the network. You could also use something like T-Shark or Wireshark to have a look at the network traffic as it's going through in this case Parrot where we have frag router running so let's actually try that out let me run the frag router command again with on the F1 fragmentation and without even launching Snore or having a look at the Remnux system let's just on, with Wireshark here we'll capture some traffic we'll go back to Commando and we'll send the pings again so we can go to Parrot and we can actually see these start to come through straight away then in Wireshark so we have our fragmented IP protocol and we're able to go and drill down into the packet information if you want and see what's going on so this might be another way for us to compare different attack types and again we can go into our terminal here as well and compare the fragmentation here